Uh, hello guys. Um, today we're gonna we're gonna go into the off season. This I believe this will be the last episode. If the off season mode takes a touch too long, I may do a part two parter. But that's what I'm planning on doing. Also, there's an option to import a draft class from NCAA 2004. So you can draft all the players you have for that game. It's an awesome feature. I highly recommend it. I, I did it once, I think. Um, it's pretty cool. So keep that in mind. I'm not doing it for this version. There's not really... Not really... Not really, um... Not prepared for that. And it, it doesn't really change anything all that much. But yes, I will advance to the off-season mode. And it's progressing it. We're going to take a look at how my team progressed during that run. Let's look here. Income, expenses. My net work was $32.5 million. Okay. Let's look at staffing. We'll start with that. My head coach is Del Rio. Motivation 86, work ethic 75, chemistry 83, knowledge 63, offense 41, defense 93. Oh man, um, let's look at my offense coordinator. Quarterback's good, running backs, eh, rough, wide receivers, rough, defensive lines, rough. Motivation, and the rest of the stuff is, eh. Let's look at Musgrave, that's the name. Let's look at my defense coordinator. E-line could use a bit is below average. Linebacker and defense backs are great. My safety safety's a bit rough. Um, motivation, all those um, they're all right. Um, special teams coordinator, I need to sign. Scott Linehan, Washburn, Bates. Bill, Bill Bellick already went back. Assistance. NFL. Let's. A defensive guy. Sean Payton. Not much there. Looking for someone. Morning, Wegg. Eh, let's just go for the best guy. Let's see if he takes it. Ah, that was a bad choice. Kicking a punny isn't good. I ate my bad. Oh well. Got that done, though. Let's look at my training staff. Cool, got that. I'm not gonna lie, I don't know. No. Alright, all I needed was that. Coach progression, let's look at this. Del Rio, three on everything, really. Two on D backs. Minus one on punting, though. Let's look at Washburn. Washburn, of course, nothing. Smith, he gained one on everything. Gained four on defense. 
Game three on D line, game two on safety. Musgrave. Let's look at him. Game one on those lost three on quarterback. That's rough. I didn't perform well there, so I can understand the loss. Uh, you can change owners here, actually. Let's see if there's any that's bad. Lions got state of the art, but they went all at 16. Let's see, I want to see if there's any bad ones. No, no bad ones. You can set prices here. And then, of course, there's that. Okay, um, did all that. Let's go. Yes. And it's simple as that, really, for that step. Um. Alright, here we go. Let's take a look. Start with rosters. See what I have. Alright, let's look at progression for my guys. Ah, Brunel! He lost a couple. I didn't perform well with them. Awareness, agility, acceleration, carrying, break tackle loss, throwing power, throwing accuracy I lost too. That's a shame. Um, that's my bad. I didn't perform super well with him. Stamina, stamina went down. His injury went up, though, and his toughness went down, though. Let's look at, uh, Leftwich. Leftwich, he went up, too, actually. I... His strength went up. His awareness went up. Agility went up. Carrion went up. His throwing accuracy went up. Man, he has a cannon. His stamina went up. His resistance to injury went up. That's awesome. His toughness went up. Good. Let's look at Gerard. Well, something improved from him. His stamina went down. His injury went up, though, but his toughness lost one. Okay, let's look at halfbacks. Taylor lost one. Eh, he is getting old. Strength went down, awareness went down, acceleration went down, catching went down, carrying went down. Ugh. Pass and runs went down. Stamina went down. His injury went up, though, which is good. Toughness lost one, though. Let's look at Toefield. Toefield, not as much as I would think. His resistance to injury went up, so I guess that's good. Let's look at fullback. Ah, last one there. Awareness went down. Carrying went down. Man, breaking tackle went down. I didn't think I played that bad with them. I mean, I went to the playoffs. I didn't really technically win any games. Pass blocking went down. Stamina went down. His injury went up, but his toughness went down. Jeez. Ah, Jackson just lost it all. Speed went down, strength went down, awareness went down, his agility, his acceleration, his catching, his carrying, his jumping. Break tackle went down so much. Negative 14. That's crazy. Two for that, and that down two. Stamina went down. His injury went up, though. His toughness went down, though. Tight ends. Brady lost a couple overall. Speed went speed went down. His awareness went down. Agility acceleration. Carrying. Breaking tackles went down. Pass blocking went down. Run blocking went down. Jeez. Stamina went down. Inj injury went up. Toughness remained the same. Let's look at the other guy. Left tackle. Oh, my left tackle went up. Mike Pearson went up three. Awesome. Strength went up. Awareness. Agility. Acceleration. Pass blocking. Run blocking went up. Stamina went up. Injury went up. The toughness went up. That's great. Let's look at Jordan. Left guard. Ah, Vince went up a couple. Uh, strength. Awareness. Agility. Acceleration. 
pass blocking, run blocking. That's good. Notice very strength in run blocking. Stamina went up, toughness went up. Let's look at Nesbitt. Probably awful. Yeah, he went down. Taking too long here. Center went down a touch. Awareness went down. Agility, acceleration. Pass blocking went down. His run blocking stayed the same, though. Stamina went down. Injury and toughness remained the same. Let's look at Inzer. Stayed about the same. Stamina went down. Injury went up. And but toughness went down. Right guard. Stayed pretty much the same. Awareness went down. Pass blocking went down one. Sam went down, injury went up, but that went down. All right, let's look at him. Let's look over here. James Williams, my rag tackle, made the Pro Bowl, so that's good. He went down by three? Come on, really? Speed went down. Oh, yeah, he's the free agent I signed, I think, actually. <laughs> Strength went down. Awareness, agility, acceleration. Pass blocking went down. Run blocking went down. Stamina went down, injury went up, toughness went down. Let's look at him. In stamina went down, injury went up, toughness went down. Let's look at Humphrey here. Left end. Oh, wow. Coleman went down eight. Speed went down, strength went down, awareness went down, agility, acceleration, catching. Catching went down for MGs. Tackling went down by four. I mean, and injury went up, though, but toughness went down. Yeah, he might be a cut. Ah, oh, man, Douglas went down by a couple. Um, strength went down, awareness, agility, acceleration, tackling, injury. Went up, though. Brackens went down by one. Alright, awareness went down. Tackling went down by one. Injury went up, though. That's good. Let's look at it. D-tackle. Ah, Henderson went up by two. Great. That's awesome. Awareness went up. Agility went up. Acceleration went up. Tackling went up. Good. Stamina went up, injury went up, toughness went up. Stroud went up by two, that's awesome. Awareness went up, agility, acceleration, tackling went up, stamina went up, injury went up, toughness went up, good. Let's look at this guy. Left outside. Ah! Aiken went up by four. That's great. I needed that for the linebacking. Strength went up. Awareness went up. Agility, acceleration went up. Tackling went up by a few. Stamina went up by four. Injury went up by five. Toughness went up by one. Okay, he did well. Let's look at Clark. Middle. Peterson went up by one. That's awesome. Let's look here. Awareness went up by one. Acceleration went up. Catching went up by one. Tackling went up by one. Injury went up and toughness went up. Okay, let's look at Slaughter here. I played. Westmoreland went up by one. I guess the left side's the one I used. Ah, wait. I had Robinson on the side. He probably retired, so I'm going to have to look out for a linebacker. Overall went up by one. Awareness, acceleration, agility, tackling went up by one. Stamina, injury went up. Corners. This is big. Nothing for Fernando Bryant. Wait, what's that one? Tackling went up by one. Ah, his injury went down. Wow, that's weird. Craft. Craft went up by two. Strength, awareness, agility. Catching, catching for a corner. When you have that jacked up, that's awesome. That's always awesome. Tackling is up. Injury and toughness are up. Good. Let's look at Mathis. Ah, he went up by three. That's huge. That's awesome. Strength, awareness, agility, acceleration, catching, jumping, tackling, 
stamina, injury, and toughness. Yeah, Mantis is a guy to look for here. Free safety. Ah, McCree went up by four. That's awesome. Strength went up. Awareness, agility, acceleration, catching. That's awesome. Jumping, tackling went up by five. That's awesome. Let's look here. In stamina, injury, and toughness went up. That's good. Let's look at battles. He went up by four. Strong safety. Ah, Donovan went up by three. He's in the 90s now. Great. Let's look here. Strength went up. Awareness, agility, acceleration, catching, tackling. Injury went down, though. That sucks. Toughness went up, though. Because, oh, yeah, I think he was hurt during part of the year, if I remember correctly. Kicker, he lost a couple. Awareness went down. Yeah, I'm looking for a better kicker. Lost a bit on accuracy, though, in stamina injury. Let's look at my punter. He lost three, though. Awareness went down. Kicking accuracy went down, yeah. Stamina injury went down, too. I am down a corner, though. I need five. That's really it. That's kind of interesting. I thought a lot more people would retire, in all honesty. Alright. Not much there. Let's look at my schedule. Alright, let's take a look at retired players. Sorry that took so long, but... But that was necessary to go through. Retired players. Alright. Not gonna look through all of them. They usually stay about the same. I'm just gonna look at Jaguars here. Alright, Smith retired. That's kind of a shame. Needed him. Robinson retired and James Trapp retired. Oh man. They will be missed. Let's look at lines just for shits and giggles. Greg Brown. They got a lot. Corey Harris, Schroeder, Jefferson, Williams, Walker, Demer. A lot of guys. A lot of backups if I remember. Resign. I don't really want to resign him. Nah, nah. I definitely want to resign him. Let's resign him. Save myself a headache. Not much there. Center, nothing. Eh, not gonna worry about that. Nah, he's old. I want someone younger. Slaughter. I like Slaughter. I'm gonna resign him. I'm definitely resigning him. Danny Clark. Eh, I'll give him a shot. Right, these guys are already signed. For another year, I won't worry about them. That's good enough. Let's look at rookie scouting, guys. I don't need a quarterback. I should worry about halfback, though, but I... I don't... If I still have Taylor, I'm not going to worry. Well... I don't know, because Tofield, I'll think... I'll have to look. Fullback. It's so hard because free agent period in this is after the draft. So I definitely need a wide receiver. So I think I should invest in a wide receiver. Let's look at rookie report here. Not much for run power. Hands and kick returns good, but. Let's look at this guy. Run power above average. Great. Amazing. I'm gonna... That guy, I don't like Rogers. He looks like a bust. Let's look at this guy, too. We'll 
Let's look at him, Galloway. Jerry Galloway. And how much there? Let's see if there's anyone here. Not much for run power. Man, eh, let's look at Lancer. How much? Looking for any sleepers. When you look through these, look for sleepers. Because you want to save those early picks. Early picks pretty well. And if you're, I'm 31 first pick, so I'm not going to get the early picks at all unless you do some trading, which I won't do. There's really no need for me to do that. I think I can get what I, can, what I need without doing all that. Not really. Good, great, average. This guy might be a sleeper. He might be a sleeper too. Okay, I did four there. Let's look at tight end. I need a tight end. Michigan guy, Oklahoma. Let's look at him. Like that guy, I'll do him. Tackle. I definitely need some linemen. On the left side at least, but I think I might go with experience for that. I think I'll skip that. For now. Let's look at I think I think I may need to get a consider getting a defensive end, but Tackling great, but nothing else. I'll do him. I don't need any, any tackles. Offensive linebacker, I need. Yeah. I don't need it. I should invest in the middle at least. I should think about corner though, just to be safe. Above average, average. Yeah, okay, so Jeez, these guys. Give this guy a shot too. Free safety. I don't need any fr any anything help in the safeties. A kicker I need though. This guy definitely. Let's look at this guy. Great, great, yes. Don't anything for punter. Let's look at my rosters. Quick scan. Half back. Should look into more to half back. Full back. Not too worried about. Wide receivers. I put have a lot in there. Tight end. He's pretty old. I may have to invest in the tight end. But keep in mind, there is free agency. Left tackle's good. Left guard. 
Center, he's alright. Um, right guard. I need, I need tackles. Guard. Tack, I'll, I'll do some tackle and guard help. Definitely. Left end. Lineman and corners. That's as much as I'm going to go for, really. I think I'm good there. Oh, wow. Okay. Let's look here. He's good. Goes down quick though. Eh. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna skip to him. I'll skip him. Yeah, I'll skip him too. Okay, I have three. Don't even kick. Let's look for... I think I may need another. I think I need another tackle in the later rounds. It's the best in the guard. Okay.
Sorry I'm not talking about it, I'm just reading these here. I'm going to skip him. Like him. Yeah, for this, I'd focus. Once you pick some guys, I'd stick with them to develop them further. But once, you, but once you think you're not gonna do it, start investing in another person. Oh, man, I kind of like him though. I'll give him a shot. I'll skip right. Like him. Uh, doesn't look good for him. Okay, I'll stay away from him. Good, I like him. Uh, I'll give him a shot. Like him. Shot. Skip him. All right, I got a couple I can look at. Let's look at. Let's look at halfbacks. Scouting list. This step is a lot of steps. This thing here. Let's look. Just gonna look through them quickly. And don't worry if you don't get everyone in the draft. Free agency period can be very helpful, so... I like this because it's pretty straightforward, pretty simple to get. Okay. All right, it's draft time. Breakdown. I'm missing quite a few guys, so <laughs> trade. For, get trade for draft. All right.
there anyone, any first round picks of my choice, left outside linebacker? Eh, I have someone a bit better. Corner. But he's second round. I want. Good. I'm not gonna pay but I'm gonna get him now. Everyone like that. <laughs> Available, my right end. Kicker, but it's only a third round. I'm not gonna take a kicker in the third round. That's ridiculous. It's okay. Still have Fred Taylor, though. Keep that in mind. Hmm. It's too early. I think it might take a risk. Ah, no one. I ended up losing a lot of my people here. I don't think I selected a wideout. Ah, shame on me. God damn it. I don't need a lineman or a left guard. Force, but I'm not picking my kicker yet. Ah, my kicker was already selected. Wait a sec, let me look at. Look at tight ends. I just lost focus. I wonder if there's any kickers. My guy. Let's look at him though. No average good. Good one here. A lot of defensive players. Good. 
Alright, let's sign my draft picks. Let's take a look at these guys. Ah, his overall is a 68 as a rookie. God damn it. I got robbed on that. We're in acceleration. Let's look at... Pass blocking's good. Run blocking needs quite a bit of work. Not the greatest pick. His injury is a bit low. Let's look at... His overall 72. That's good. For a rookie right there. Speed's good. Awareness. Alright. Acceleration's amazing. Catching's 42's good. Tackling's awesome. Tim Johnson. Let's look at him. 64. Okay. Speed. He's slow for a running back. Jeez. No wonder they booed me on that pick. Acceleration's 99, though. It's catching solid. Carrying needs work. Break tackles average. Tackling. God, this, that guy sucks. But who knows, he might improve. 64, ugh. Speed's good for a corner. Strength needs work. Awareness needs work. Agility, acceleration. Catching's a bit rough. Carrying, jumping, tackling. Uh, Stamina injury. He's pretty he's pretty good with the last three. Let's look at Grand Jones. 51? God damn it. Speed's low. Strength. Tackling. <laughs> Break tackle. Jumping. Carrying. Catch. Man. He, he's reliable, though. Overall, it's 52? Come on! Man, my picks suck. Awareness is good. Let's look at kicking power. 86. Accuracy, 69. Jeez. God, I did not pick the best guys. So overall, it's 55 for my right outside linebacker. Speed, awareness. Tackling. Jeez, I did not do well. At all. I still need to fill some positions out a lot, so. All right, free agent signing time, guys. Let's learn. Next time I'll do a two-parter, but it's too late now, so. I need wide receivers badly. God, there's not, they don't have a lot. He's fast, though. Okay. Yeah, not a lot of good players. Wow. Gary Walker's pretty awesome. But I don't need him.
man, that much help here. Well, then again, these guys will be back up, so... Sign this guy. Man, free agency isn't what I like it used to be. I need more wideouts. I'm gonna have to sign a bunch of wideouts. Need someone with a bit more speed than that. Come on. Oh, this guy's. I'll give him a shot. I like him. Look at Westbrook. I like him. Guard centers. Give more, some more cornerback love. Alright. I need free, free safety and a strong safety for backup. I should resign some more players. I let too many players go away. That's my bad. Yeah, this is going to be over an hour. I'm so sorry, guys. This is the first time I'm, I'm doing this, and I did not estimate how long this will take at all. So, apologize for that. Gonna... For now, it'll just be a one potter, or next time I can just be more aware. Maybe not spend 20 minutes on the, <laughs> the progression. I put a lot of money in free agents, and that's because my draft picks were not good. 
good. Well, I have cap room still, so I'm good. Let's look at a uh, breakdown. Strong safety and guard. Let's look. Are these two strong safeties and guards? Strong safety and a guard. Okay. Let's advance another day, and then I'm good. look at my breakdown do I I still need a guard so I need to get a guard oh fullbacks let's look at speed Patrick pass ah, I'll give him he might help out but I need a guard Yeah, I'm over an hour, but I'm going to look through the video and see if I can cut some parts out, try to make it under an hour as much as possible. It's advanced. Good, got all those. Let's look here. And I got some money left over. Not a lot, but enough. Simulate it all. I got all the players I need. Okay. Let's reorder the draft charts. Let's take a look. Okay. Um. Brunel and Leftwich. That's that's a pickle because Brunel is technically still better, but man, Leftwich is just looking so good. Yeah, pretty much sticking who I have. Fullbacks. I like I wanna give Patrick Pass a shot because Edwards is solid, but Pass has that speed that's just killer. Ron Dixon. Not much for re receivers this year, which sucks. I got a lot of old receivers. I wanted to draft one and I should have. Tight end. Tackle. still playing. Maurice Williams might get the edge. Levi Sanders, the rookie. 75. He was undrafted free agent. He's not very fast. He has great awareness though. Great tackling. I'm going to have to get him in. Let's see if... 75. Ah, uh, he's a 70. He's not going to get in there, unfortunately. Let's look at left outside.
Now, yeah, have them start there. That'll help things out. Safety looks good. I'm stuck with Richie again. Let's And yeah, now we're back to restarted way back when. Um, so yeah, at this point you would pretty much go through the same thing I showed you earlier. You have the training camp. You would probably focus on the rookies, try to get them better. But a lot of my rookies aren't going to be starters at all. So, so I'm not really going to put too much focus on them. I, my, the biggest mistake I made was not drafting a wideout first round. I was just thrown off, and I should have drafted a wide receiver. Now I'm stuck with scrubs, and I'm going to have to lean more on the running game. But you never know. I might, I might trade for someone. But, yeah, if you guys want to see me continue this franchise mode with the Jaguars, with the roster I have, just leave something in the comments and I will. But for now, this is how I'm going to end it. I'm not going to continue this until, unless requested. Because I showed you showed you everything. Um, but, yeah, guys, that was the whole mode of Madden 2004. And I have to say, I, I love it. And the only real flaw, I think, is that 30 seasons is a long time for something like this. And I don't know really anyone who's completed a full 30 season thing of it. Even with simulating every... Even if you simulate everything, that's still a lot of time to, to, to invest in. But... But yeah, um... I'd say drafting in free agency for this part's probably the trickiest because... Free agency, you don't get a lot of great players available in free agency. And the draft process, I mean, the scouts, scouting's great, but I thought, based on my scouting, I was going to get decent players, but I got a lot of 70s and 60s. And granted, back in this time period, the Madden ratings were a bit, were a bit more um, harsher than nowadays. But, but yeah, um... Thanks for watching, guys. Please subscribe and like the videos, and have a good day.